Hi everyone, welcome back to the avocado series. This avocado is almost eight feet tall and we started it from seed almost 18 months ago. As you can see, it has quite a few branches and it's looking really healthy aside from a few leaves that got sun scorched when I first brought it outside. Now the trunk is really healthy. It's rather large and stable. Now I just wanted to mention that our avocado tree has only ever been in a soil mix of sand, perlite, and peat moss. And every time I pot it up, I continue to keep it in the same mixture of equal parts of all three. And we do give it a weekly fertilizer, which is the avocado and citrus. I'll pop a picture up on the screen so you can see the exact one that I use. And as you look up, you can actually see that right at the top, it still is pushing out tons of new branches. This tree wants to be probably 20 feet tall, but I will have to prune it so that I can keep it under cover. I'm not sure if I'll keep it outside in like a kind of a greenhouse scenario or if I'll bring it back indoors. But here you can just kind of see the structure of it. There's quite a few branching on one side. The other side is a little bit more sparse. Here's a look from the other direction. But as you can see, this tree, like I mentioned, is almost 18 months old. I have not pruned it once and it has put out a tremendous amount of growth and branches. So I do think that the only reason you would need to prune your avocado trees earlier or ever is just to maintain its height. So if you're wanting to keep your avocado tree at say six feet, then you would prune it in order to keep it that way. So in my case, because the eight foot tall is now too high for me to want to keep inside the house or in a greenhouse, I will have to prune it, in which case it'll push out more hormones in order to produce branching. So just looking up the side of the tree here, I just want you guys to get an up close view of it. It's really one of the most beautiful trees I've grown. I've really enjoyed the process of growing the avocado. And I'm a firm believer that with avocado growing, you don't need to start your avocados in water with toothpicks. All I simply do is take my avocado pit, I clean it, and I put it right into my mix of sand perlite and peat moss. And then I just consistently water it until it starts to sprout. And then just uh, pot it up every time you see the roots have hit the bottom. And that's really it. The avocado pit has all the nutrition that the avocado tree needs, probably for the first six months or more. But I hope you guys enjoyed and we'll see you again in a couple weeks.